This panel comparison video will be split into three categories, viewing angles, color, and refresh rate. And this video serves as a purpose to guide you guys to pick the right monitor panel for your own needs and application. I'll include all the links and reference in the video description below. Let's start with TN panels or Twisted Pneumatic Panels. They were the first LCD monitor create designed to replace this aging CRT monitor error. Now they face from limited viewing angles. Straight on, it looks fine, but when you're viewing off center, you notice that the color comes distorted and it has that faded washout look. And TN panels generally does not have white color garment space like NTSC or Adobe RGB. So this may shy color centric applications away from TN panel because like photographers, videographers, and designers who depend highly on color accuracy, TN panel may not be a choice. However, TN panels are much more affordable, cheap to get, especially for gamers in mind. I'll talk about refresh rate a little bit later. VA panels or vertical alignment panels is a balance between TN and IPS panels. It has more advantages over TN panels than IPS panels. It has better viewing angles and color reproduction, but it's not that close compared to the IPS panels right there. Now, again, this is an affordable uh, monitor. It's somewhat a little bit pricier compared to TN panel, but it justifies the price. People like me, who are part gamer, who is looking for high refresh rate, say 120Hz, and also who are part photographer, videographer, who wants a decent color garment in that panel to do basic color adjustment, correction, and grading for simple photography, videography work. IPS panels or in-plane switching panels was designed to solve all of TN panel hiccups. They have superior viewing angles and color reproduction. They offer higher contrast ratio, better blacks, higher color accuracy, and wider color gamut like Adobe RGB and NTSC. Usually used by photographers, videographers, and designers as the color is the main focus right there. There are basic IPS monitor for home application which is affordable and also there are professional grade IPS monitor that offers the widest possible color garment space like Adobe RGB for professionals like photographers, videographers, designers or whoever depend highly on color accuracy and color reproduction. That can be a little bit pricey. The one thing I never mentioned yet in this video is refresh rate. Now in the past, TN panel is known to provide the highest refresh rate and is great for gaming experience. And IPS panels during that time were the big time loser when it comes to refresh rate. But now, IPS panels is capable to go beyond the 60Hz limit and is great for gaming experience. Based on 144hzmonitors.com, the highest possible refresh rate for an IPS panel is 165Hz, for a VA panel is 200Hz, and for a TN panel, still the refresh rate king at 240Hz. Now, as time progresses, other panels like VA and IPS is capable to catch up to TN panel. But still, still, there's a price concern right here. If you compare, say, 165Hz of a TN panel and 165Hz of an IPS panel, the IPS panel that provides better color accuracy and color reproduction is still much more expensive compared to TN panels. So if you're solely on gaming, TN panels is the best. Now, if you're looking for color reproduction and color accuracy, you want to go something for like photography or videography, you want to go IPS, or you want the maximum ultimate godlike limit like for gaming and also color reproduction and color accuracy you can go ips but the price is the main concern right here there's not many who can afford the premium price that's where va panel sits in between literally the v sits in between the balance between uh, tm panel and also ips panel and it's much affordable between the range and you get the best of both worlds now i hope this video is a little bit in, uh, informative for you guys to choose the next monitor for your purchase i hope you like this video links comment below what do you think we should talk about next when it comes to monitors and all these other technologies remember to like subscribe and comment below see you guys in the next video